I donated to Biden, which I did. I supported Kamala Harris from day one, which I did. I I even starred in Biden's victory video, America the Beautiful. I was in it. I did more in the 2020 election to to actively work for someone's campaign. I did more than I've ever done in my entire life for any candidate whatsoever. And I'm disgusted. I said, I, and, I, and I said, a year in, I'm disgusted with them both. I'm disgusted with Kamala Harris and Joe Biden. I have been a consistent Democratic voter for 16 years. I voted for Biden, thinking that he was the safe, thinking that he was the safest choice. Before I voted, but before I started supporting Biden, I was a Kamala Harris supporter. But but Biden, I'm furious at. Furious at. What do I not like about the Biden administration? Well, uh, day one, day one, Biden turned Title VII and Title IX inside out. If you want to know why you have Leah Thomas, that man swimming in, uh, competing against women, in, in, uh, in swimming competitions, that's why. Gender identity. If I had known Biden was this much of a genderist, there's no way I would have voted for that man. No way. I am upset about the Afghanistan withdrawal. The video of refugees dropping from C-117s uh, to their deaths will haunt this presidency and will haunt this country for decades to come. I don't like critical race theory. Critical race theory is a Trojan horse that has a lot of darker elements hiding inside, like the diversity, equity, and inclusion movement. I don't like the idea of kids, black kids, white kids, whatever, separated by race and then made to feel like one group is oppressed and the other group is not. I don't like where we are now with COVID. Masks don't work. CDC has said CDC said so in May of 2020. Omicron is a weak variant. Everyone knows that. And you're still trying to enforce this kind of stuff on people? Why? Why? Who's benefiting from this? I am seeing the Democratic Party. I'm seeing my party headed into the wrong direction. I am seeing Joe Biden going into going into these dark realms, making all of this stuff. All of this stuff that has no place in schools, that has no place in society, that is how the party destroys itself. That is how liberals become so, so far over to the left that they become completely unrecognizable from what they used to be. I don't recognize where we're at anymore. And I'm pissed about it. Democrats, I need you to listen to me carefully. The fact that I, a registered Democrat, am appearing on Fox News, I don't have a grift, I don't have a thing, I don't have a gimmick, I don't have a brand. And the fact that I, a blue-collar Democratic worker, am speaking to Fox News should scare you and scare the rest of our party. The fact that they're willing to talk to me and MSNBC and CNN are not, that is a problem. And that should tell you all how far we've fallen away from the common man.